Hi everyone. So I'm going to show you some rough footage of my moving into the new facility that we did over the weekend and what it looks like right now. We moved from East Palestine, Ohio to North Lima, Ohio. If you're familiar with the area, I moved from a town with two red lights to the outskirts of Boardman slash Poland slash Youngstown. So I moved into a city. I'm about 20 miles from my house. It's a nice straight drive. We'll see what happens when I got six inches of snow. Those will be snow days and I'll be staying home. So we have our new office here. I just came up the stairs. And as you can see, this right here is storage. It's got a low ceiling there, but it's an awful lot of storage we can use. And that's the network of the cables. I have to hook them up. It looks like at one time there was a switch box or something there. They just unhooked them all. It sucks. But I'll fix that. Then you have over here combination break room reception, you could call it too. It's more of a break room. But it's a reception because it's the front door. Then you come in here. I, I would say break room only because somebody installed a sink here, which is good because I can use it. Then we come in here and we have this big office here, which has been separated by this little partition. As you can see, that's the outside. Then we continue on. We got a partition. It doesn't go to the ceiling, which is nice. And then this was left by the previous tenant who were architects. And they're mine now. I got that wide carriage print. That's going to be awesome. And that drafting table right there is going to become my new bench. This will probably be my studio. And then this right here, maybe my work area. And then this right here would be my coding area, I think. I kind of like the idea of laying it up like that. And this out here, I'm going to actually set up as a reception slash break room. I'm going to get a little futon or couch or chair or whatever, some TV set up, things like that. But that's the new office here. And now I'm going to do some cleaning. And then tomorrow, we get busy moving in. So it's Monday morning. And Everything has been moved. This was a big, a B, you know, bitch. This was hard. All of this stuff. I moved it all by my lonesome on Saturday. Out of the old building, into the truck. Over here to Ohio, from the parking lot to the building, up this flight of stairs, and in here. Over 200 times up and down those steps carrying these boxes. Would it be in 25 degrees? Snowed uphill both ways. Now the fun begins. Put it all away. So a brief tour of the new facility. We're almost done putting things away. Trash, ignore that. These are the steps that I climbed over 200 times moving in here. As you come in, you can see things here. This one right here is a room with a short roof. It's just my storage. I'll go through stuff and put things away, but it's my storage. This is the reception area. I need to get, I need to get a futon or a little table or something out here. This is the reception area. You 
Once we leave the reception area, we go through the store here. This is my command station, my main work area. I do all my developing on there. I do all my photoshopping over there on the laptop. That computer there, I watch YouTube and do my accounting. My things over here are my tchotchkes, my things my wife made me. Floors creak a little. I'll get used to that. Let me come over here. This is the ColecoVision Studio. This is the video equipment over here. The Adam setup. The backdrop for the ColecoVision. One of the video games we've made so far. Then through this door in here, this is the bench work area. Camera above the bench. This is an older drafting table. It makes a really nice bench. I've got to put some stuff away still. These are a few boxes I have things I just have to go through before I put them away. Box cases for for Adams, my Atari stuff. The box down here is members stuff that I'm working on, bench stuff that comes to the bench. Things like that. And then on this side over here, I'm gonna put a table over here or a desk. Probably a table for assembly when I do cartridges. And so what we, we will film this is, here I'll stand up in here, basically podium style. That door will be closed over here. So when I do updates and so forth, I'll be standing right here in front of all the ColecoVision goodness. It's got that 80s vibe going behind me with all the stuff and the sign above me. If I got to do anything on the Atom, I'll do that over here. This camera, I can put down on the floor for recording. The camera I'm holding right now, we're going that tripod right there is giving me dual camera for the Atom. I'll have dual camera for in here. When I'm running the bench, doing hardware or anything like that, I have the overhead camera and then the camera I'm holding is my secondary camera that will be pointing here. So you get dual camera there. And there we go. Like I said, this is the command center. This is where I do all my worky. And I need a futon or something right there. Maybe a little table over there. But we're in a new place now. It's got a nice view outside too. I mean, it's the weather isn't very nice, but nice intersection. You got a cemetery across the road. Down below me is a really cool off-road. They make um, four-wheel ATVs, specialized ATVs for racing downstairs. It's really cool. But there you go. So this gives you an update what's going on with 8-Bit Millie Games and the 8-Bit Millie channel. Have a great one.